What's your views on the Hope mission by ISRO? What are the implications and what's the possibility of the mission being a success? Hope mission. Let's let's quickly Google it. It's it's a mission designed to simulate the conditions that you encounter when you're living on Mars or possibly the moon. So ISRO Hope Hope, and this is in in Leh. Uh, not not in Leh. It's in Ladakh. So this mission is is happening in Ladakh. Where where do we see? Which one do we see? Let's take a look at this. Uh, ISRO launches Hope mission in Ladakh to simulate astronaut life for Gaganyaan. It's a 10-day high-altitude mission, isolation mission. So you'll have this sort of, you know, igloo kind of facility in which you'll have some people who will stay, will be isolated for a certain number of time, certain number, number of days. The Russians have and the Americans have done such missions in the past. So isolating astronauts, on the earth in simulated environments that uh, are similar to what you will find if astronauts will be on the moon or on Mars. And the Russians and Americans may have done missions that are in excess of one year long. This mission that we are launching in Ladakh, it's a 10-day mission, high altitude isolation mission. August 1, it was launched, so it could get over in a couple of days maybe. It's at 14,000 feet. It simulates the extreme conditions that astronauts might face on long-duration space missions to the moon or Mars. It's part of preparations for India's Gaganyaan human space flight program and future interplanetary exploration. There's a two-person crew. ISRO has selected somebody who's a PhD candidate at Purdue University and somebody else who is a planetary science graduate from the University of Aberdeen because maybe Indian universities don't have anybody. I don't know. What's the deal? Anyhow, so it's a mission that's designed to simulate the conditions that astronauts will face if they are on a mission to the moon or Mars or maybe space, isolation and so on. It's good. Will the mission be a success? Of course it will be a success. It's a 10-day mission. Anybody can survive 10 days in isolation with somebody else. But the real problem is when you are, when you are stuck with somebody for a year or two, Let's say you are traveling to Mars on a, on a space capsule, a spacecraft with, uh, with let's say, a three-person crew. The travel, the, the, the voyage to Mars will typically last about nine, ten months. Okay? If it's during the launch window, the optimum time to launch to Mars. So you have three people who are in, in a small capsule stuck with each other. If you're stuck with somebody that you don't get along with, it becomes a nightmare. So you have to do psychological profiling and what so much more of each astronaut to see whether they are compatible and they'll be able to work well together. And then you have to prepare them for such missions by doing things like this HOPE mission. So you simulate the conditions of, of a space flight, of a long space mission. And are you able to survive together in isolation and get along together and do all that's required and so on. So that is what this mission is like, this HOPE mission. It's a 10-day mission. Eventually in the future, we'll have longer missions that will happen. And Ladakh is a great environment for this sort of mission. It's very isolated, very few people there, uh, very uh, very harsh climatic conditions, high altitude, whatnot. So it kind of simulates be, being stuck in space or, uh, you know, being on a mission to Mars or the, or the moon or something. So yeah, uh, it's great to see this happen.